Hey y'all, welcome back. Got my earphone in so you guys can hear me because I'm on this dumb iPad. So, yeah, so, so um, I um, have a thrift haul, as you've seen on, by the title. I found some really pretty pieces at Goodwill on Midway over in Carrollton, I want to call it. And, um, and, you know, I'm on a Goodwill boycott. However, I did stop in there because that one normally I can find something. But I'll show you the first thing I got was this. Dolce & Gabbana sunglass case or glass case. Now, this is what I realized was wrong with it. This piece is off. See, it goes right there. It just got to be glued back like this. I'm going to pull out my hot gun, glue it back, and I got a Dolce & Gabbana eyeglass case. Now, this, um, I paid a dollar for it. So, I don't think that was a bad deal. So, yeah, I'll fix that, and I'll have that. It's nice and hard, too. Nice one. Um, okay. Is this cute, y'all? Look at that. Look at that print. Look at the flowers and the grays and how they blended and faded that. That is gorgeous. This is vintage. It is from Winterling. And it's, it's called Winterling, I think. Right? Yeah, Winterling. Or that's the company or something, but it's from Bavaria, Germany. Gorgeous, y'all. Sugar and creamer. And these were both 99 cents a piece. And then I was looking for something for the Goodwill Challenge, but I'm not going to use this for that. Um, but I already had, and I was saying to myself, why are you going out with, looking for something for the Goodwill Challenge? You know darn well you got something around here. But I was glad I went in because I found this. This was $4.99. Gorgeous. Would you look at that? Oh, would you look at it? So, in such good condition, too. Not a chip. I felt around it. I shaked it to see if it was a porcelain. Now, what I would do, it, what I'm going to do with this, I'm definitely going to use this if I, you know, next time I have a gathering and have tea out, I'm definitely going to use it. But what I will sit out is um, Pottery Barn or um, Crate and Barrel, the, um, their uh, porcelain cup and saucer sets. I got every one of them. I got all kinds. So I'll use all white with this and just let this be the star of the show because I won't even try to mix that with anything. You see that? I, that's closer to maroon than anything else except for I would call this like a blood red. Yeah, it's really pretty. It's really pretty. So I got that and then I went to um, Hobby Lobby, which is not thrift, but I'm going to throw this in here. This was, now I, I told you I'm redoing the area whole area in here and i'm changing i'm doing like a french country so is you know farmhouse included in french french country um more so comforting now it's not going to be the exact style because i add my own style i like what i like and i add to what i like um when i'm when i'm decorating but i am adding some of those pieces too now i got the chairs my chairs has this pattern i have um like club chairs a squared off club chair um, the new chairs that I just brought and then it's, this is the fabric on the chairs, right? So it's the uh, French script and I think it's the same exact one. I'm not sure, but it's not as close. I got two yards. So I'm either going to make one curtain panel because I have a teeny bit window there that has to be, or, um, I was thinking of making some pillows, but like, do I want to be that matchy matchy with this? I don't know. So I got two yards because then I thought I'll do a curtain panel. And then if I had any leftover, I would do a um, one little small one to add on the sofa. Because I did buy a couple pillows there. Not exactly the same French country, but, you know, I mean, the same French script, but similar. So anyway, then I, when I went to um, the outlet, Family Thrift Outlet this week, I got some shirts. And the week before, I got some blazers. For 50 cent a piece. I'll put that video up. Actually, I'll, I'll um, can see if I can put a link to it in the bottom of here. Good stuff. Found some really good stuff there. And um, I got 20 pieces for $10 with the clothing. Right? And um, anyway, I got two other things. And that was it. That was this week. Wednesday. I mean, uh, Tuesday just passed. I got a stocking. Is this now so? You see, now it's going with my French country theme. Right? This is going to go, and um, I don't even know where I'm going to put the stocking because I never 
but I'm going to put it somewhere just because it was so cute. It's burlap and it has the Florida Lee. It's so cute, right? So I'm going to use that in my uh, dec Christmas decoration this year, decor. And then I got some more napkin rings. I pick up every time I go somewhere, if I find them. I got these for 50 cents. Oh, that, that stocking was 50 cents too on Tuesday. And then I got this napkin ring, set of four. Blue beads, glass beads, cute. Couldn't leave them, couldn't leave them. 50 cents for four, had to get them. So got that. And then I got some bags. I went to Texas Thrift on Good Friday. And I did good. I didn't even go out till late. I didn't go out till like 2.30. Because at first I kept saying I ain't going nowhere. Then I said, well, let me run this Texas through. I found this bag. Now, the name of the person on the bag, y'all, I, I can barely tell. It is, oh, it's Polini. It's, uh, what's her name? Lena, L-I-E, L-I-N-E-A, Polini, Polini, Polini. Yeah, I, I would say it that a hundred times twice. It's uh, made in Italy. And I looked it up. These bags sell really good. And this is in perfect condition. I, I'm not like, this wasn't a bag that I ever, her brand was never something. I've heard of her before. But um, the Polini brand. But I never got into it. But look at the detail in this. Look, the name there. Look at the basket weave with the leather. Oh my God, it's just gorgeous. And um, the inside, look. Got the name in there. It's really nice. And y'all, this bag was $6.98. And Good Friday, all the thrift stores had 50% off of everything. So I got this for 50% off. Um, so it was what? $3.50, $0.49, Really nice bag. I'm going to put this up for sale too. This is going up for sale. So um, I got to price it. I don't know. I'm going to look it up online and then come up with something. I got that, and then I got, I got a jewelry jar from there, too. <laughs> oh, God, I was going to pull y'all down. I forgot I had these earphones in. I got a jewelry jar, too, but I put it up with the other jewelry. Um, I found this one. This is cute. Y'all, check this out. Look how, look at the condition of this bag. Look at the leather on here. It's a crossbody slash, wait shoulder bag or the crook of your arm right turn crossbody child seriously wait coach I know it looks dark in there because the bag's so dark clean as a whistle Coach Creed, gorgeous, gigantic crossbody going up for sale. It was $9.98, so I paid $4.99, ish or something like that. No, two, $4.97. Is that cute? Look at that. Big old pocket in the front here. Blue interior. Silver on black. Silver uh, metal on all black. Shiny, pretty leather. Somebody clean this thing up. Yep. And then I got this for myself. Now, I'm going to ignore the fact that it says national, national mortgage. Because it's a black leather case, right? And I like this for taking quick notes for something. When you're doing something, if you're looking for something, it has all kinds of little slots and stuff in here. But again, I mean, I probably would use it if need be. If, if I had a coupon for a certain day for, you know, here's another thing. When you're out thrifting and you know that you got four, I meant three William Sonoma um, brasserie mugs with the green rim. You put, need one William Sonoma brasserie mug with the green trim. This can fit in your pocketbook. And when you're in a thrift store, if you're like, do I need that? You could flip through. I don't do that because now I got a thing in my head, but I'm going to start doing it again. I got a little file cabinet in my head, thrift file cabinet in my head. But I'm going to start doing it again because I have been finding myself over-purchasing, buying things 
three times because I forgot that I did get it again, you know, when I was looking for it. So I'm getting into that. So this can fit right in my bag and I'll be able to pull it out. It's organized. If I get a coupon from a thrift store, I could put it in here. Some thrift stores still hand out coupons um, or specials or something like that. So I can put that in here. And I thought that was cute for 99 cent half price. What? 50 cent. 49 cent. Cute. Then... That's, I think, is that it? No, I got one more thing. That was it, y'all, this week. I ain't doing a whole lot. Oh, I got four. I got one jewelry jar, like I said, from Texas Thrift. It was $9.99, so I paid $5. Y'all will see them, because I put them away with my jewelry already. You know, I got to hide them, because they get to chit-chatting to me, want me to open them. And then I got four bags from, um, four jewelry bags from, where, uh, no, because that's all I got from there. Yeah. From Thrift Giant. I got four jewelry bags. And um, they were $14.81. Three of them were $14.81. Half price $7.40. And then um, I got those. And then I got one bag that was $9.99. Half pay price $5. So I paid $7.40 for three and $5 for the other one. And they're coming up. I actually did a, a video on one. I got to redo it because... Um, YouTube was saying it couldn't upload. It couldn't do something. I don't know. Tried to upload it twice the other day. So that's why I was missing a video on Friday. But. Oh. Is this cute? Y'all look at that. It's by. And I can't say this word. This name. Jack. It's J-A-Q-U. J-A. J-A-C-Q. Wait. J-A-Q-U-E-S. That's what it is. Couture. I just thought, y'all, that was too darn cute. Look at the condition. Look at the fact that there's no fading on this whatsoever. And it's clearly vintage. So cute. I fell in love with it. I had to have it. They had it marked for $9.99. I got it for $5 because it was half off on Thursday. Texas Thrift, East Dallas. Uh, not Texas Thrift. Thrift Giant, East on in, on um, Nash, mm -mm. Northwest Highway East. And then the only other thing I got was this. Would you look at this wallet? Patricia Nash. So cute, look. It was $6.99, half price, $3.50-ish. Look at that. Excellent condition, y'all. Excellent condition. Patricia Nash. Extra, all these little card slots here. And that doesn't open up there. But look at the carving in this leather. This girl is amazing with her work. Look at that. The carving of the flower in there. Isn't that cute? But yeah, that's all I did. I told y'all I'm on a, um, a fast right now. I, want, I got some Dollar Tree stuff, but it was cleaning stuff. Some, um, a whole bunch of cleaning products I, did, I got yesterday. Other than that, I have not been buying. I have been doing excellent. Haven't uh, overspent at all. So, all right, guys, I will talk to you soon. I'm going to put this one up today. I don't know if I'm doing anything else. I'm, I've been busy around here getting some stuff done. And, um, but tomorrow I'll be back with another video. All right, guys, I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.